Chip and Joanna Gaines' youngest child is already proving to be an impressive gardener. On Tuesday, the 43-year-old mom of five shared a precious video on Instagram of her youngest child, Crew, showing off his thorough gardening skills. In this week clip, the youngster walked around their family home diligently watering all of the pots, making sure all the flowers got enough water. He wanted to check on his tulips last night. Pretty soon, the garden will be dancing with these beauties. Joanna captioned the video. The Fixer Upper Welcome Home star likes to update fans on her little one's latest milestones. <laughs> Earlier this month, she shared another video on Instagram of her three-year-old showing off his skiing skills during a family trip to the mountains. In the clip, Crew effortlessly makes his way downhill with a little help from his dad and siblings. Jo also captured shots of her elder kid zooming by and was very impressed, captioning her post, they all ski circles around me. I'm just going to stick to my roller skates. Skiing isn't the only snow activity crew is a fan of. The Magnolia Network star also shared a video of him sledding down a hill, but when she tried it out herself, it ended in a bit of a wipeout. Chip and Joanna have accomplished a lot in their 18 years of marriage, fixing hundreds of homes, launching their own home and lifestyle network Magnolia, and raising five kids but their love story is far from over. Last year, the couple told Axis Hollywood's Kid Hoover why divorce is not on the table for them. This is why I watch everything y'all do. It's this dynamic that, that we love right here. I'm thinking about your 18th wedding anniversary, the five kids, all the success, all the fame that's come. Has there ever been a moment for the two of you where you thought you were gonna throw in the towel or that you couldn't do it? Mm. I, we, we, I, one thing that I would say is our superpower is that Joe and I are not quitters. I mean, throwing in the towel is, is not something that honestly ever even comes to mind. And I would say that that happened pretty early or early in our relationship where we just thought it's interesting that divorce or leaving one another is not really an option for us. And so somehow that little, that little foundation has definitely served us well because things have definitely been challenging. We're not perfect and, and we have issues and trials and errors just like anybody. But, but I would say that it's funny when you say throwing in the towel in fairness, I would admit if we had considered that along the way, but, but relationally we're in it for, for forever. You know, it'll never not, this'll never be a gossip mag that we don't make it. That's how it ends. And I can kind of see the end of that story. And then when I think about difficult things that we've done, and I would say the, the real estate crisis of kind of like 2006, seven, eight, nine, 10, you know, it didn't hit Waco till a little bit later. So it's a little bit of an extended period that I'm referring to, but you know, that crisis, Joe and I had multiple opportunities to quit and throw in the towel. And that was just not in our, in our DNA. And so now I think we've taken that and realize that, you know, it's like, you can't ever lose if you don't quit. And Joe and I keep showing up day after day. And sometimes it's right, sometimes it's not, but we, uh, but we keep putting one foot in front of the other.